Hello and uh, welcome to the China8.com demo. My name is uh, Saw Johnny. I'm the founder of China8.com. Um, it's, uh, it's a pleasure to be here and to walk you through um, the site. So I'll just start off by um, typing in the URL of China8.com. It's China-8.com. Just type that in. As you notice, I'm using Firefox here. Um, I'll just type that in. I'll just wait for the page to load. Okay, here we are. Um, the site starts off with an intro flash. And below the flash here, we have two links. One of them is to the 1.0 portal, which we just launched recently. And the web 2.0 desktop, which we, we kind of launched the site with um, earlier uh, in October. So I'll just start off with the desktop. So now we're, we're logging into the desktop. As you can see, it's loading. Um, uh, quite a few of our users have had problems with the desktop for some reason. I guess the desktop ma metaphor in the browser is not something that they, they are used, used to. But it's actually quite simple to use. We just have a bunch of icons here and the whole application basically runs on this single page. Um, so I'll just start off by logging in, double click this, and here is the, the login window. Just type in my username and my password, uh, click login. Okay, so the page is now going to reload uh, with my kind of personalized settings. As you notice, before I logged in, um, you know, the site was playing back some uh, Chinese music, which is our default China music. Um, we've got a little player here which you can use to turn on and turn off the music. But now that I'm logged in, the site actually plays back my music, which is MP3s that I uploaded previously. I'll walk you through uh, the upload process um, a little bit later. So I can just stop this music here, and um, we can then move on to, to some of the other icons in here. Um, the next icon here is Sign Up, which is pretty self-explanatory. Uh, you just double-click that. Uh, if you don't have an account, you can then go and, 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 and fill, in, fill in this form to sign up to the site. I'll just close that. Um, the third icon is My Settings. And my settings is basically where you kind of personalize the China8.com experience. Um, you notice that we have four tabs in here. The first tab is photo. So this is basically my, my user photo. This photo will appear in the instant messenger and in the blogs and elsewhere in the site. Uh, you know, this, this basically is, is, is my, my visual identity. So basically, I can upload a photo just by clicking choose file here and selecting a file for my computer. So that's, that's pretty straightforward. Um, the next one is wallpaper. Again, I can ch change the wallpaper of, of China8.com. Um, I can either uh, choose one of the default wallpapers here. So right now, as you can see, I'm using this one. If I want to change it to this one, it's just a question of double clicking it. As you can see, the background has changed here, and the wallpaper has changed here. Or I can I can I can choose this one, you know, for kind of more China look. This is a picture of Guilin. Um, um, or if I if I want a, an uncluttered desktop, I can I can click this nice gray one here, or this black one here. Okay, there we go. So we'll stay with this one. Um, another thing I can do is I can upload a wallpaper for my desktop. So I'll just uh, I'll just walk you through that quickly. Okay, uh, let's find let's find the wallpaper in my desktop. Okay, here we go. Um, let's go into my documents. my pictures okay let's see what we can find here okay um, 
Okay, here we go. Like these. Okay, these are some standard um, Windows uh, desktops here. Um, I just click, just click one of these, and we'll upload it. Okay, upload complete. So after the upload, all I need to do is basically refresh this, and you will see that the new wallpaper has appeared here. I'll just double click that and that's now my wallpaper great um, I think I'll change back to this one <laughs> and I'll show you the mp3s so here we have the mp3s these four are default generate mp3s these are mp3s that I have uploaded um, I can upload some more using pretty much the same process that I, I used just now um, the fourth thing in here is uh, my stats. I just click that button and I get statistics, which kind of tells me how I've been doing on the ChinaRate.com site. So, uh, as you can see, I've completed 11 out of 88 exercises. You know, that's 12.5% of the course. Um, my average score is 97%, so I've got a few wrong in there. I have 43 flashcards in my library, I've learned 61, I've uploaded one wallpaper and, and four mp3s. I have six friends in my instant messenger. Okay, so that's my settings. Pretty simple, pretty straightforward. It's used to personalize experience. Close that. Um, here's my profile. Again, if I want to change my profile, my email address and so on, I can do it here. And all these windows can be maximized. Um, kind of restored to their previous um, size and uh, minimized so they come down here in the taskbar I just click that again to open it I'll just close that okay um, the chat lobby is basically um, you know where you it's like a, a welcome lobby where you go to kind of have a quick chat before doing whatever you came to do chinarate.com the next um, Icon is uh, a logout icon. I won't do that right now, but I'll, I'll, I'll do that a little bit later on. Um, so this brings us to Chinese lessons. Uh, I think most people who come to our site uh, are actually here for for the lesson. So I'll just double click that. As you can see, there's a little bit of a loading screen here. We'll wait for that to load. Okay, it's pretty quick. So here we have the the lesson window. I just uh, as you can see I can resize these pretty easily I just resize that and make it a bigger screen I just scroll that this is, this is the lesson dialog um, uh, basically I can also perform lookup on these Chinese characters so you can see me is you and how is good Xiao Jie is miss or young lady um, Sen Cheng Mr. Bang Yu help okay so you know this is this is like pretty uh, it's a pretty good way to look, to start learning Chinese. You have some dialogue, you can look up individual words, um, and then you just take it from there. Um, I'll just go quickly into the vocabulary for this lesson. Again, that's loading. Can kind of wait for it to load. We have quite a lot of vocabulary. Uh, the idea is that you go through them slowly at your own pace. So here we have, you know, ni and how and so on. I can click this and we can have a little bit of a listen. Ni. There you go. And uh how. Okay. So I now know how to pronounce those two words. Um another thing I can do is add any of these words to my flashcard library. So I'll just click add and it tells me here that it exists in my library already. Um I'll try another one that exists as well. So as you can see I've been through this lesson kind of adding adding stuff to my library. Um, the other thing is we have here is notes. So There's the lesson notes um, and grammar. Um, you know these are for like people who are quite serious about learning Chinese. Uh, I think the casual user will probably uh, gloss over these but that, that's fine too. Uh, the next thing is exercises and you know we're quite proud of our exercises because they're very tightly integrated with the lessons um, 